Hello everyone, it is Toby here and we are doing a Strongman events session today. So first I'm going to work up to a couple of heavy log singles. I'm going to be doing 107 kilo because I'm still building back on the first block of push press since the uh, knee injury. So 107 should be about right. I expect it to fly really easy. We don't want to overload the legs too much and then it will just be a bunch of shoulder accessories as normal. But I won't show you those because we're going to be doing some fun strongman events towards the end so we're going to be doing some tire flip with the brand new massive tractor tire and some sandbag throwing as i know you guys love to see that because it's all i'm doing at the minute and if we get time i might do uh, a few other bits and bobs but we will see how we go will's going to attempt to flip the tire potentially potentially uh, it's quite a light tire it's only about 180 to 200 kilo uh, which in strongman terms is a very light tire uh, I'm mainly going to be using it just to nail the technique. In my competition, I've got to do a really heavy tyre at 350 uh, kilo for six flips in the quickest time. So this tyre is going to be perfect for nailing the quick transitions between the tyres and uh, getting the technique nailed down. So I don't expect it to be particularly hard, but it's certainly going to be a good challenge to learn the technique as well. Hopefully, fingers crossed, the weather stays clear and dry and doesn't start raining because tyre flip in the rain is not a very smart thing to do. So that is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna get warmed up on the log and the next thing you'll see will be my top sets of log press before we move outside. press done and dusted as predicted it moved like a warm-up really excited to be getting back into some heavy log pressing no idea what i'll hit a comp but we got some high aspirations considering 107s moving that easily i followed that up with a strict press set of eight at 82 kilo which felt good uh, felt like it was starting to get a bit tough which it would be because 82 for a set of eight is definitely a pb on strict log so really really happy with that now I have got, as I said before, my accessories, which is incline dumbbell bench, lateral raises and rear delt flies, just to finish the upper chest and shoulders off before we head outside, do some tire flip and some throwing. So the next thing you will see will be me after the accessories, just before we head outside. So I'm all done with my accessories now. Will Shock is still benching, as usual, always. <laughs> as always. Um, I'm about to head outside and get tire flipping. Uh, the weather is not ideal, but it is not raining, so it'll be okay. It's still quite damp everywhere. It's very moist, very uh, humid, but it looks as if it's going to stay dry for at least a bit longer. And the tyre doesn't seem that wet, so uh, I'll assess the situation when I actually get it out. But it looks like it's going to be fine to do. Um, obviously, tyre flip is a very dangerous strongman event and has claimed the lives of many a bicep, so it's, that, it's the sort of event you really want to save for good conditions, under control, but because it's a lighter tyre and it's not raining, uh, I think it's probably good to go ahead and do so. So yeah, as I said, this is going to be a lighter tyre, so it's mainly going to be technique work for me today on it. We'll try and get a few sets of flips in, uh, get it nailed down, as this is the first proper session of me flipping this tire. I flipped it once before when I was emptying out the stagnant water from it and got absolutely covered in stagnant water, which wasn't nice, but I've since drilled a hole in the bottom so it doesn't fill up with water anymore. Uh, and yeah, gonna head outside, gonna get some flips in and you'll be seeing those right now.
the big tire a go after he's seen how easily I've been flipping it, but I'm gonna give him a quick technical tutorial from my limited knowledge of tire flipping. Um, and I thought that'd be good to share with you guys as well. So with the tire flip, you obviously don't wanna curl it. That's said, so in your hand position on the tread where you've got a good grip, so you're not relying on the grip. Then you wanna get as much of your chest in contact with the tire as possible. Have you got that, Will? Well, you know, just yeah, give it a go um, and don't curl it. Yeah. <laughs> Wherever's comfortable. It, your hands should literally just be there as a, as a place marker. Your chest is doing the driving. All right, now drive with your legs. See? Use the treads rather than the actual tire. So hands on the tread. There you go. So drive like it's a scrum, knee under, flip to a push, and yeah. Easy peasy. So as you can see, it's it's diff more difficult than it looks to get the technique right, but yeah. when you get it, it's nice and easy, isn't it, Will? and a bit muddy as well. <laughs> right, I'm gonna probably smash out one or two more sets, then we'll move on to sandbag toss. flip done I am absolutely covered in muck now but it felt easy waiting on Loz's feedback for the technique um, obviously as I said lighter tire so I need to figure out how I'm either gonna weight it or um, where I'm gonna go to train on a heavier one but to learn the technique here on my own it's good enough Will got some good flips in as well yeah I did a couple not too bad for a power lifter not bad <laughs> but that was good fun now we're at two hours into the session I'm going to rest up for 10 or so minutes, go out and throw some sandbags like I do every strongman event session because practice, practice, practice is what you need on those. Uh, so I will show you a few of my sets of that.
Well, I wanted to get some more sets in, but the rain literally just started coming down thick and fast, so had to run everything inside. I'm a bit wet, but <laughs> we got there in the end. I'm really happy with how those throws are going, uh, getting them super consistently like that. I did a set off camera where all four went over, and the set you saw on camera where I got a set of four, and then I went, decided to go for a set where I just keep going until I failed one, and that was five bags with a really close sick there. Um, which is really good because in competition I've got um, five bags ranging from 18 to 26 kilo in two kilo jumps. So the fact I'm doing the 22 kilo bag, which is the middle one for five solid reps like that is really promising. Uh, and I, it's, it's turning out to be a good event for me, I think. So really happy with how they're going. I didn't want to get in another set of five or two, but uh, yeah, the rain called that one off pretty quickly. So that is actually where we're going to leave today. I did maybe want to get in some loading, but uh, with it raining, sandbag and keg loading in the rain is a recipe for disaster. So we're going to leave it at tire flip and sandbag throwing, which was a really good solid session. Uh, Loz was happy with my tire flip form. He just said more practice, more practice uh, until it comes to second nature. Using those hands as hooks instead of pulling with them is exactly what I was telling Will to do. Uh, so we're getting there. It's the same as the sandbag. The more practice I get on it, the better I will be at doing it and getting my conditioning up. And then hopefully when we come to use some bigger tyres nearer to the comp and in the comp, uh, they'll be moving just as easy as this light one. And then, yeah, as you see, the sandbag throwing is just getting better and better each time uh, I record it for you guys. Every week it's getting better, uh, which is exactly what we like to see. So really pleased with this session. Will's pleased with his tyre flip. Yeah, it went very well. Yeah, didn't injure himself, which is always... Yep. a good one um so that is where we're gonna leave today thank you guys so much for watching if you made it this far please consider hitting a like and subscribe comment down below what strongman events you want me to train next uh, obviously they're tailored towards the comp at the minute but as soon as the comps are out the way we will be back to training whatever we want so let me know and otherwise thank you guys for watching i've been toby and i'll see you in the next video